got it, y'all. I got it. I had to. I just had to get this. There's no reason why. $30? I mean, yes, pricey, but this thing is huge. And then it lights up. Like, can y'all see the colors? Oh my gosh. <laughs> so my new plan with this, because I'm still gonna keep the other decor, but I'm gonna put this in my bar area because remember I have those nice little glasses that have the skeleton on it. These, I have these y'all. <laughs> and I have the bougie couple. It's gonna be like kind of glam or spooky mansion party, just in like the bar area and the, I don't even know what this is called. Is it the sitting area? This was the dining room area. Yeah, I think this is like dining room, but then I changed it to like the sitting area. I would say this was the living room, but I feel like this is the living room. <laughs> but now I'm excited because I know that it's gonna be a different theme in that area. Now, in the kitchen, the plan is still to have everything super orangey and black, white, everything supposed to be more whimsical. We are gonna see. As y'all know, I'm indecisive about a lot of things. And this is just only for Halloween decor. This is not for the Halloween party. It fits so perfectly. And I even have room in the back to push it back. Oh! Sorry, y'all. I'm excited. As you can hear, it's storming. And I'm outside playing in the dirt because I need to transfer some of my plants into another pot. Today was a heat advisory. And you're probably wondering, if it's so hot, why do you have this blanket on? Because it's raining and it's actually cool outside. Plus, my citronella plant is on a water break, <laughs> which means I'm not trying to get bit up because these mosquitoes are savage out here. So now I'm just trying to get some of these sticks out. I mean, yes, there's an easier way, but I find this quite relaxing to dig in the soil like this. <laughs> Some lettuce that I gotta put in. I've been sitting here trying to think what I want to do with my garden. I do have a lot of my plants in a row and I do want areas that I can go like in between. So I want it to go straight this way, but like in between and then like this way. Hey, on the ground dead. I guess the horseman fell down y'all. Have some more. <laughs> These are huge. And the discounts and the vouchers <sighs> smart i picked up from joanne which apparently was the last one i 
got it. I've been looking for these. Now I still need to get that skull with the melting candle that looks like this, but I got this, okay? I'm very excited. I feel like I'm probably gonna put this on my mantle instead of like books. I think this would look better on my mantle, not sure yet. But I am very excited I got this. It says originally 60 bucks, but 40% off, so I think it went down yeah, like $30, but I had a 25% off coupon. So I didn't pay more, more than like maybe 25, 29 at most. So, ha, y'all know I had to go get them. This is a female, okay? It's a female skeleton. I know a lot of people look at the skulls and be like, oh, it kind of seems like a male. No, because when I die, I'm gonna look like bones too. This beauty, I gotta figure out a name for her. She's so cute. I'm all yelling, I need to calm down. But I got her and I had to get, I'm gonna call them a him. Cause I just think they look so good together. Uh, I think this will either be in the bathroom because I need a whole room that is showing all gold and it will nine times out of 10 be the bathroom. Which is not my bathroom, it'll be the guest bathroom. So it'll be looking real royal. I also, even though I have candles holders like this, which is normal and it's gold as well, they're really, really tall. So I didn't really want to use that in the bathroom. Plus they're in my office. So I decided to get the shorter ones and they have spiders on it. This was $10. I got these from TJ Maxx, TJ Maxx, TJ Maxx, okay? This skull was $12.99 and the bus was $19.99. Also from TJ Maxx, I got some purple nails. Look, it's all jacked up, but who cares? It's purple nails that have that like look on it. I had also bought these from Five Below. I thought these were stunning. So it kind of goes for the theme in my bedroom, which would be more like witchy fortune teller vibes kind of like a mixture between those two so i love the the stargazing the moon and i want to like accent it with these nails so like maybe my ring finger or my thumb like you know do it like that just play off of these two but i thought these were a great combo these are five dollars and these are six dollars that concludes my haul hopefully it'll buy anything else I mean, there is Target and Big Lots and Home Depot and Spirit of Halloween. We, we just gonna hope I don't buy nothing else. Dashing has definitely paid for most of this stuff. <laughs> so I don't get to touch my account that is like reserved for bills, but Dashing is just only giving me more opportunities to get more stuff. I just put some gas in here and then others, I just buy Halloween products. Send help. Ding dong, I know you can hear me. Open up the door. I only wanna play a need to organize Tristan's room. I'm going to move this rack and move it up and move this one down here so he can have clothes hanging down here as well. Yeah, I need to fold some clothes. I want to get rid of this entire thing. <laughs> And I really want those trees that I seen on Amazon to go up. Also, he's gonna get another bed set. He's supposed to get a twin bed. This is still like the crib size, y'all. So he's eventually gonna get a new bed. And I need to do all of these tables to have like one neutral color. It's still gonna be the pencil and stuff, but I need like a neutral color because this ain't it. I want to spray paint this black. I'm trying to unclutter all of this. Some of this stuff he don't even play with is gonna have to get done. <laughs> is gonna have to go. So this is what we're looking like right now. I'm gonna have to pause this because I have to get my son, but look at all these shoes he got. I swear we ain't pay for all of this. <laughs> I would like to pause this vlog. <laughs> if you do not like ratchet music and hood rat things, <laughs> you want to end the video right here. <laughs>
because we went out, me and my girlfriend, and had a time, okay? It's a little bit explicit language, but it's music, okay? Like, we can't help it. We had a good time, okay? <laughs> I warned y'all. I did. I warned y'all. <laughs> Currently conditioning my hair. Son came out here and fell asleep right beside me while I was editing. <sighs> this was a good week. I would like to bring up <laughs> one thing. I understand that I'm married. I have married friends. And a lot of people are on the fence about, which is I don't know. I, I just think it's weird, but a lot of people are on the fence about uh, women going out and having fun. Like, I don't feel like you have to only go out to restaurants and stuff. I feel like you're able to go enjoy entertainment. I love to dance. I love to hear the DJ. That's probably something that's never going to, like, stop, like, ever. Um, do I like crowded areas? No. Unfortunately, it got crowded and that's when we eventually left but we had fun we just had fun and i know a lot of women are like i wouldn't go out and did it out go to like something small or i'll stay home and that's good and that's okay for you all but i like to go out just like tonight my husband would go out and it's my turn to hang out with my kiddo you know we take turns we have a life we do things, you know. Sometimes it's rare that me and him can go out, but it's either a family's in town or we can get a babysitter. And we turn up. But we have a good time. That's just what we do. And each is on for each couple, each person. But we have fun over here. <laughs> if you ain't know, we have fun over here. There's a lot of footage <laughs> that don't make these vlogs. I hope y'all have a great weekend. We gonna have fun tonight. Hubby gonna go out, me and son. We gonna have our own little chocolate turn up. Milkshake wasted. <laughs> Y'all have a good weekend. Bye.